Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Jake Smash. This is another Watcher of Realms video. It is 1421, Monday, January the 15th, and we're going to talk Arena 2.0 for just a couple minutes. We're going to talk about the competitive aspect. Overall, I think the changes that were implemented with Arena 2.0 about two weeks ago, I think they're a good thing. I think they're a step in the right direction. I think they benefit the majority of players. We can discuss all that later. But this video specifically, we're going to talk about the competitive aspect of Arena Now versus 1.0. So in Arena 1.0, uh, the clan, MAD, that I happen to be a part of, but this video has, that's irrelevant to the video. They have dominated Arena 1.0. They had dominated Arena 1.0 for a very long time. They were the only ones winning. Um, Basically, someone would save a bunch of resources, take out a massive lead, ride it reset, and then no one would, you know, have a chance to catch up with them. With this new system, it prevents that from happening. So even if you stockpile resources, you can't get too far ahead because the number of points that you get is dependent on the difference in score between you and the person that you're competing with. So if you are more than 500 points above the person that you're attacking, you're only going to get one point, period. So you can't get a crazy lead. You can only get more than one if people are uh, a closer proximity to you in score, right? So it makes Arena much more competitive. It really does. It makes it so that even if someone stockpiles, they still... There's still strategy involved. You still have to push. You still have to think. It's not as simple as it was. And that's really a good thing. It honestly is. It opens the aperture for a lot more people to be competitive in arena, in PvP. And PvP is a big part of games like this. People love PvP, right? Moonton has some work to do with this one. Um, but overall, step in the right direction. And this will get more people engaged in going for that top spot. We can see, if we go to the rankings, we go to last week's rankings. Last week, Mad didn't win. Well, this was about 12 hours ago at reset. Mad didn't win. So is their reign of terror over? Uh, maybe, maybe not. Who knows? Uh, it depends on a lot of factors moving forwards, right? Mad is still going to be very competitive, of course. They're a strong clan. But uh, are other people able to compete now? Yes, they are. Um, and that's really only a good thing for the game mode as a whole, for Watcher of Realms as a whole. And honestly, it's better for MAD too, because it forces us to, um, you know, uh, strategize more, get better. It, it, uh, it, it prevents winning in a very easy way. So all of that is a good thing. Uh, so, and that's really all I wanted to talk about was that this is a step in the right direction. Arena is better now than it was. We still got to work on some stuff. Again, different videos are going to discuss that, but from a competitive aspect, we're going to get more people involved and that's going to be good for the game. That's going to be good for Moonton. And the only real thing that might be a little frustrating, right? Is that, uh, so I am central time in the United States. So it resets at 0 2 my time. So if we go to the West Coast, we're talking about midnight. Mountain time is 0 1. East Coast is 0 3. Um, that's that's suboptimal. Uh, so I don't know if maybe Moonton will do a rotational reset, maybe to accommodate folks in the Western Hemisphere, right? In Raid Shadow Legends, it's been the middle of the night for American players forever, and it's just been a pain. And some people stay up and push. Uh, every single week and other people don't even attempt, even if they have stronger accounts, because uh, it's just a pain to, to stay up and strategize and time your, your, your attacks and everything for those last couple hours that late at night. So if, if that was rotational, that'd be great. It would help out folks on this side of the world. But even if it's not, this is still a good thing. So kudos to you, Moonton. Uh, still work to be done. We'll talk about that. But overall, positive step in the right direction. Good job. This is my video. Thank you so much for your time. I will see you in the next one.